Whoa, whoa, no, 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 no. Oh, I got stuck. Damn it. I can't go back. You bastard. Oh, that is evil. That is so evil. Eh. Well, we definitely need, need to focus. Oh, boy. Kind of forced my hand. Do, 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 do. Sucker. Just keep absorbing MP. Since we didn't get to rest, or save beforehand. Freaking thing. And I don't even get to collect my my prizes for winning those rounds. Trench Crab! Got more FF5 enemies. I think he just did slow. Wow, with focus, your MP goes up pretty quickly. That's pretty nice. Underwater. You would think. But in the Final Fantasy world, you never know. Crab Claw. Ooh, that sounds yummy. Crab Claw. I want a Crab Claw. Where's my crab claw at? There it is. A hard, powerful crab claw. Is blind still on? Yeah, it is. Okay. We can do something about that. A little eye drop. Or clear eyes. So in a way, this is kind of like Serpent Trench, because you got the different directions you can go. It's just not... It's just not automatic. Not sure if the different paths take you to different stuff. Remedy! Do, 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 do. Oh boy. Don't slow me! Can't do that on television. You can even do that underwater. Crab Claw! Give me some Crab Claws, sir. I don't know which way to go. <laughs> Not a clue. Just do a little more focusing. Stop trying to blind me. Do, do, do. Keep getting that MP up. <laughs> I heard him zero. Because I'm strong. I'm army strong. Let's just keep going to the left, I guess. Uh. Okay, at first it wouldn't let me through. Water rod! I guess if you want to get all the chests, you, you, you got to go through here a few different times. Not sure how we're actually going to get back, but... Water! Magic up by three. The fire rod gives me more magic, so... I'm not going to bother with that nonsense. Magic up by three. Now... Jeez, the water rod kind of sucks. For magic, anyway. Bum, bum, bum. One shot. Oh, magic is so OP. Do, do, do. Finally, I'm not being pushed around, bullied by the water. Potion! How about you find some Phoenix Downs? 
That'd be nice. Do 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 do. They do bowl roll. Oh my god, that hurts. Oh my god, twice. Seriously? Like one of them almost one shots you, and you do it to me twice. What is up with that nonsense? Oh god! All the pain and suffering. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me with this. Death. I guess it didn't work. Thank God for small favors. Those guys are annoying. Jeez. They're just like little plants. He kept doing thunder to one-shot me. Energy drink! Phoenix down. Uh-oh. I see a boss. Or a mid-boss or something. You want to kill this guy quick before he starts pelting you with thunder spells. And one-shotting you into oblivion. Alright, we need to heal. I think we're good. Uh-oh. The middle leaf. Whoa! Sildra! From FF5. Ow. He did El Nino! Oh, that's nice. Ironically, his don't seem to hurt as much for some reason. <laughs> like, bosses and mid-bosses are usually easier than regular enemies. That's kind of how this game rolls. Fire! I'm out of MP. Oh, jeez. So far, he hasn't been able to one-shot me, so that's kind of nice. Ow. He can come close, though, with my white mage. Super boss! Oh, water does not work well at all. I think an X cure would be very nice. Oh, God. I need to use Cure with you. Clean sweep. With a water dragon. Water too. Whoa, holy crap. This guy's a lot of HP actually. This is one of those rare moments where I need to actually cure with two people. Got him! He was actually pretty tough there. Mainly because of AoE attacks. Thousand gold! Sildra was dropped. Ooh, can I summon Sildra now? That'd be pretty badass. Ooh. 
Good night to Spirit of Soldra. Guess now we can summon you. Ma or Maelstrom. I, I guess that works. Summon Soldra Water Elemental. Takes 40 MP. It dropped itself. It dropped itself all over the floor. I had to pick that trash up. Oh boy. Now where are we? Sildra does seem lightning elemental, but it says water here, so... Didn't it say water? Yeah, water elemental, so I don't know. Water lightning, I guess. So now we're back at the beginning of the game. So that's pretty awesome. Do, do, do. And we fight beginning game enemies. We need to focus. Oh, I wanted to call you, but I have no MP. Bum, bum, bum. Now, you can't really change what it shows, unfortunately. I hope they fix that in the sequel. Because I don't really like that. Like, I kind of wish you could just zoom in. I, 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 I think that would be a lot better, but I don't think you can. So where's Branch Castle? I think it's over here. But I don't know. Do -do -do. Screw was dropped. Water front. Okay, Branch Castle is to the east. Yeah, there's Branch, and then Branch Cashel. They need to leave me alone! I've got stuff to do. I'm trying to focus here. <laughs> Alina can't even one-shot be beginning game enemies. That's sad. Alright. Do, do, do. Branch Castle, which is where you start the game, if you didn't know. Nothing to report. Good day, sir. Are you, are you off on an errand for Lord Adder? No. I'm back from an errand. I heard that the crystal weakened a little bit recently. I wonder why. I don't know, man. I need to sleep, I know that. Rest. 40 gold. That's like nothing. I like how sometimes we get the FF5 sleep theme. And sometimes the FF9 sleep theme. And this room here just kind of looks ridiculous to me. I don't know. Just like the beds. They're just like, I don't know. They just look so weird. Maybe that's just me. Alright, we're rested up. It's good stuff. I went into the dungeon early, earlier that Iblis General wouldn't stop yelling at me. Is he trying to rile us up? I'm tired of sitting here all day. The blood red armor only symbolizes one thing. Combat. There's no way to think, soldier. The branch dragon, dragoons, are peacekeepers now. You should know this. Sorry, sir. I don't think that dialogue changed at all. Vaughn returned to the castle and told Lord Adder everything from the attack on Mesidia to Malachor. In turn, Lord Adder discusses the escape of General Brock and Hans's pursuit of him. Are we going to go back to Hans now? So, this being, this Malachor, who you found in the Golgar Volcano, was using Darius as a way to release himself? To relieve himself is more like it. Yes, and it seems that is why Darius was acting so strangely as well. Malachor's influence made Darius think normally. 
It might be safe to assume that he was somehow influencing Darius's mind or feelings for a while without him being aware that he was being manipulated. Indeed, as of late, he hasn't been himself, threatening Brock, attacking Hans and yourself. I knew something had to be amiss, but this, very surprising. I want you to try and capture this Malachor being for me, Vaughn, but you will most certainly need the assistance of Hans. Capture Malachor? Why? Isn't a threat like him just better off dead? Not in my eyes. We should capture him and study him. After all, he is the only link we have left to King Branch. Malachor is a gateway, you see. Oh boy. By running tests on Malachor and interacting with him, we should be able to get a glimpse into what made King Branch desire so much power. He's the freaking Mad King! His secrets, his reasons for craving the power of the crystals, is within our grasp, Vaughn. We can finally put the pieces of the puzzle together. Yeah, I don't know about this. I suppose you're right. Pardon me. Lord Adder, first I would like to say that it is a real honor to meet you. You are a very admirable man, worthy of the praise I hear from your people. I can see how capturing Malachor would be a good idea, and on paper, it would work. But in the end, after you would find all your answers, what would you do with him? Good question. I'd expect nothing less from an Ivalice general. Unfortunately, I have not thought everything out that far ahead yet. But I think it would be best if we found a way to draw his power from him. Whatever magical energies flow throughout him, they very clearly belong to the crystals of element and the nations which protect them. Yes, I agree, but it just doesn't seem right. I think your approach to this is really awkward. I gotta agree with that. I can understand that. I wish that I could make things more clear, but we are dealing with a dangerous foe capable of bringing about the prophecy. You mean the Black Moon prophecy? Yes. We must act. Sir? What prophecy are you speaking of? I suppose you've never heard of it, as you have grown up in the military. Your friends here, the two magicians, are sure to know of the prophecy, though. Indeed. Unfortunately, yes. Vera, do you know? I'm afraid I'm in the same boat as you, Vaughn. I'm not sure what the prophecy is. What is this prophecy? I suppose I should tell you, as it is certainly necessary to do so. Here we go, plot dump. Vaughn, I'm speaking of the Black Moon Prophecy, of course, whatever that may be. It pains me to even mention it, but it is clear to me now that it must finally be discussed. Black Moon Prophecy? It sounds like an RPG Maker game. Yes, the prophecy has been whispered amongst people for as far back as the human race can remember. Well, what is it? Essentially, the end of the world as we know it. Of course. Why not? Like, prophecies are never like the saviors or anything. It's always the end of the world. What? It is said that the crystals of element keep the balance of the world in check. Disturbing the crystals could have dire consequences. So basically the warring triad. Wait, hold on. Malachor destroyed the fire crystal. So how come nothing happened? It is only when the crystal's energy is dispersed. Malachor is holding it within him, so in a way he is acting as the fire crystal now. Oh boy. But as I was saying, the crystals maintain the balance of the world. If all four crystals were to be disturbed, their powers destroyed. Then the alignment of the world would go awry, and the elements would vanish from our world. The planet would be engulfed in a terrible darkness, a sickening taint. But what would happen then, nobody knows. We would be in the world of ruin! That is all that is known about the Black Moon Prophecy. Do you see why it would be imperative that we keep Malachor alive, at least for the time being? I don't know about that. I do. So I should go find Hans and then look for the next crystal. 
Yes, for whatever reason, Malachor seems to want to grow stronger, using the crystals. We cannot allow this, for the sake of the world. Go to East Branch, Vaughn. Han should be there in search of General Brock. Brock? Do you know Brock? General Brock was the best of the four generals. Vaughn, Decker, Eva, and I were always viewed as being inferior to him. Decker! It does not surprise me that he was able to escape. He probably had a way to do so the entire time. So you think he was just playing with us, then? Being captured may have been part of his plan. I'm not sure what he could be up to, but he doesn't work independently. Lord Zool, Ivalice's military chief, directs him. Deckard. So this Lord Zool, he would have been the one who sent Brock here. Why would he do that? Maybe just to determine whether or not Branch is still a threat. I can't say for sure, but we should look into it. No, okay. Lord Adder. Yes, you should definitely look into that as well. But I feel that the current issue with Malachor may be more important. Agreed. But how will I reach East Branch? Hans used the Serpent Road, but for whatever reason it has stopped working at the moment. It could be Brock's doing. The Eternal Blue is docked a little further to the north, along our furthest coast. We've excavated... Excavated? Totally spelled wrong, but okay. Excavated. Part of Old Branch, under the castle which leads up that way. Simply head down to the cave network under the castle to find it. Okay. Old Branch? I'm afraid to know what I might find down there. I'm sure the four of you will be able to deal with anything you find down there. Now go, Vaughn. Hurry to the Eternal Blue and East Branch. So, of course, at the beginning of the game, you can actually go down there and fight a dragon boss, who's, who's pretty tough. L looks like you've got your hands full. Yeah. You will find the entrance to Old Branch in the cave under the castle. Hurry, time may not be on our side. Alright. Nothing going on back here, okay. So we gotta go under the castle now? Bum bum bum.